Hello, I'm Mark Camosio, and we're here on a lovely day at Pete's Air Gun Farm. And I'm here to show you a um, rather nice pistol. This is the brand new Sheridan Cowboy from Crossman. Um, obviously, Sheridan are another air gun brand that's all under the Crossman umbrella now. And um, this is a very nice pistol, I must admit. It's um, CO2 powered, and obviously, it's uh, um, a sort of Wild West um, replica style pistol. So, you've got the um, the enjoyment of owning a um, sort of authentic looking pistol as well as a working air gun. Um, it's, uh, as I say, it's based on the Remington 1875. Um, some of them, when I looked into this, some of them are badged up with that and others are. This is actually stamped with Sheridan Cowboy um, on the actual casting. But um, it's all very nicely made and it's got an authentic feel to it. It's got a lovely amount of uh, um, the sort of machining is, is of a sufficiently high standard to feel quite high quality it makes all the right noises and we'll, we'll get to all that um, but it just it does feel quite authentic um, all I would say is the sort of one of the few negatives is that they've sort of missed a trick as far as they could have been a bit more detailed on the grip um, I must admit I'm not sure about the original whether that came as plain like that but it just feels like it could do with a bit more detail but it, the handling and the feel of it is very very nice um, I'll just quickly show you the um, CO2 side of it. So it's powered by a 12 gram CO2 capsule and to get to that you've got to split off the grip, the little indent on the bottom. You take that out and uh, inside the grip, I had that out already, you've got a small allen key um, and that just inserts into the base of the grip and then you just undo that until it's the, the capsule is actually um, free. So I've got one in there already. Um, so that one's um, been used, so we'll get rid of that. And then you can take a fresh CO2 capsule, place it into the chamber, and then tighten this up until you hear a small hiss. That's it. Carry on slightly till that shuts off. Then we can stick that back in there, like so. Snap the grip back on and then the power is all ready to go. Um, now the whole revolver system all works as the uh, original um, big set with, with the bullet casings that come with it and there's two sets of six by the way um, you have to push a pellet into the reverse of the um, casing. I'll just do, I've done the others but I'll just do this to show you. So you're just pressing the pellet totally flush so the whole system will keep working it won't catch and then once you've done that um, Pull the cock the hammer to sort of the half stage that allows the rotation on this. Open the gate at the back and then drop your bullets into each chamber, like so. Just do that. You get two sets of six here, as I say. Um, they are actually badged up on the bottom um, or marked up on the bottom uh, as one as a pellet set and one as BB. Um, I didn't find any difference in, in the actual performance, they, all could, they could all shoot pellets equally well and personally I wouldn't recommend um, the BB side of it because you just do get ricochets, I'd always shoot pellets and um, this, this does it very well. So once they're in place um, then you cock your hammer fully on this, it's only single action so that means you set the trigger prior to firing, there's no double action where you'd be pulling through the whole um, sear pressures. Um, and then it would sort of be a slightly faster cycle but with this it's single action so you've got to prime your pellet like that I'll just fire these off that's all the way there we go um, but the actual firing cycle of it and the, the chambering and the feel of the whole revolver system is very good. And as I say, once you get it in your hand, um, it's, you, you can feel the, the sort of quality of it. It's a very nice pistol. And that's running on CO2, as I say. Um, you'll get eight, 80 shots on a 12 gram cartridge. Um, it's only in 177 calibre. And it's um, 169 pounds at the moment. Um, as far as power, you're, it's around about the 2.5 foot pounds, but we're not talking power with this sort of uh, pistol. It's the, the fun shooting aspects of it. Having said that, I mean, I've had, I've had sub-inch groups at 10 yards with it, 
so the performance is um, good enough as well. Um, so all in all, it's a very enjoyable um, CO2 pistol to use. So that's the Sheridan Cowboy from Crossman.